welcome to Maker Wednesday with the Fulton County Library System. My name is Ms. Jenkins and I'm from the Washington Park Branch. And today we'll be making water bottle wind spirals. To do this project, all you need is some water bottles. Big ones are good too. The two liters are good. Markers. I have my permanent markers. They must be permanent markers. Sharpies are good, but if you can find some permanent markers from the dollar store, it'd be great. And some scissors. And don't forget the string. We need the string. Let's get started. To make your wind spiral, you need to take the cap off of the water bottle. Take the paper off. And this little tie that's on the top here. I'm going to take this little part off the bottle here by cutting it off with your scissors and then just taking it right off. See that? And then what you're going to do, using your markers, you're going to color your bottle up and down or across, whichever way you want it to go, with different colors. I'm going to start with blue because it's my favorite color. And I will start at the top. And you're going to color all the way around. Doesn't have to be perfect. Remember, permanent markers are best. You just keep coloring until you have it all colored. Once you finish coloring it, it should look like this. The bottom is not colored because I'm going to cut the bottom off. So let's proceed to cutting off the bottom. Punctured a hole and I'll proceed to cut off the bottom where there is no color. There we go. Bottom gone, see? Now we're going to Cut this in a spiral. You just begin down here and just go cut, keep going around till you get to the top. If you want it thinner, you can thin that whichever way you want it. Now we have it. This is it. Came out pretty good. I love the colors. So I went outside and found me a branch. Look at that. Isn't that a nice branch? And I'm going to take a 
my spirals and I will do the whole of the mouth right here. I will slide that right on in there like that. And then I will slide the other one on because I have more than one, see? Slide that one on through the hole right here. Slide that on like that. Tie a piece of string on the end. See, tie a piece of string there. Knot it. Slide another one on. And then I have another one right here. I'm gonna slide that one on. And then you can take it and tie the two ends with the string, knot it, and you can then hang it on the wall in your house or hang it outside on the tree limb to decorate it. There you are. They pretty. You have it with the wind spiral hanging on the tree so that the sun can catch the colors. This concludes our program for today. Thank you for joining us. See you next time. Bye-bye.